let's have a look at this Thermaglow rechargeable LED hat and unbox this one. It should be pretty quick, as you can imagine. It just slides out. Let's have a look at the packaging first. Rechargeable LED hat. So this is a basically woolly hat with an LED inside. Four super bright LEDs, three light intensity levels, up to four hours of light, fully rechargeable, 90 lumens. Let's press the button and you can see it sort of lights up. We'll get it out in a mo. And then as I press it dims. Thinsulate insulation, so that's a brand from 3M, who I think make post-it notes and uh, big firm. Thermaglow rechargeable hat, insulate, little instructions on the back. You can also charge it uh, just by plugging it into a USB port. Let's slide it out. There's some more tech specs. And have a look. So that's what the hat looks like. Feels like a nice material. Little logo sewn in there. What have we got inside? 3M Thinsulate. Some washing instructions as well. So this is acrylic. There's also, if we turn it inside out, you can see there's a, a warming layer as well. So um, it's not just this material, there's actually an inner layer to it as well. But the exciting bit for this is this little lamp. So that's what it's like on. Pretty bright. I think this is pretty inexpensive. I think it's about $10, something like that. A couple of modes, very easy to use. And then I believe it's sort of magnetic at the back. There we go. So we just pull it out. And if I pull this out, there's the USB. So that just plugs into a USB port to charge. There's a little cover, sort of slightly rubberized, obviously to kind of keep the moisture out. Probably goes on this way. And then when you've charged it, you pop it back in the hat. Seems to go, I guess, this way, or maybe it doesn't really matter. Pop it in. There should be a magnet. Or maybe it's quite subtle, the magnet. And it pops in like that, maybe it clips in. And uh, with the lip anyway, it keeps it secure. Looks pretty nice, looks pretty stylish. It's a nice black, seems to feel quality product. I'm gonna give it a seven out of 10.